today is my last full day off from work before we go to the beach I have to do a lot of chores and a lot of those chores involve charging up speakers if you don't know what this is is a TDK speaker it's like little tweeters all the way around and a big subwoofer that's downward firing it comes out the side ports but that's water resistant and so is this one this one's the big beach daddy right here everybody's like what they look around they're like uh what we got there young man well we've got the project boom g boom yeah something like that hell i don't even remember the name target has these i think it's like 80 bucks i think 80 to 100 worth every penny because this is strong enough the frame is you can use this as a chair and just sit down on the top but the bad thing and what sucks the most if they would fix it i'd probably sell off every bluetooth speaker i own if they would fix the battery life guy here which is the three lg 360 cam we're gonna go see the new independence day film so that is going to be the movie reviewer the gopro hero 4 which is in this nice case. I have the waterproof case. I'll probably do all the vlogging while I'm there on this right here and do the camera there vlogging on the way down and the way back. I don't like to expose anything to the elements at the beach. Look where the dogs hang out all the time. That's their corner. Oh, this is really, really loud. Like, ridiculously loud, but... Yeah. That's what I bought at Goodwill for five or eight bucks whatever it was and I wash like sprayed washed and cleaned out the back of my truck and the back of my truck also has a trunk down in there which is awesome but you can also use as a cooler if you wanted to there's a drain plug in the bottom but I cleaned all this out for the beach trip because everybody's gonna be packing their stuff back here and I want it being dirty and I've had this running for quite a while and this was brand new man I'm just amazed but you can see it's getting clean there's a little bit of water I think I'll stick it in some other spot clean this out after I'm done well drying this out after I'm done drying this out I'll shut it and then do the rest of the back and get it all dried up because I have a uh, uh, cover that folds over and locks uh, to cover this up so get her nice and uh, cleaned up for the trip but make sure not only do you uh, check the air pressure and all your tires before a trip also air up your spare tire now mine's back there in the back with the trunk really easy unscrew two bolts the whole tray slides out and you just pick up your spare and that's it it's probably the best vehicle i've ever, I've ever owned as far as convenience that's why i have it may not look the best and i get picked on for having the six cylinder truck but it's super convenient getting to that spare is so freaking awesome compared to other trucks i've had in the past pain in the ass but uh, make sure to fill up that because that's 60 psi mine mine is over here and uh, I think it was it wasn't even registering even though it felt like it had air in it, it wasn't even registering on my gauge it took a ton of air to get it up to the uh, 60 psi that's supposed to be so just remember to do that because you never know what happens and for tonight's cuisine is pork chops spinach and who makes this rice Uncle Ben. Uncle Ben's rice. So we're off to the beach. We're, we're loaded up. Uh, well, we're not really off the beach yet, but we will be soon. But we got to carry our two little dogs. <laughs> Look at her smiling, but they're in the floorboard. No room for their carrier. <laughs> yeah, we had zero room for a carrier in the back, so they're having to ride in the floorboard. Hopefully, they'll be okay. We are loaded up completely loaded up like we got three people that's gonna sit in here pack other seats and then the back this is where it gets packed and you're like oh it's not so bad well i have a half the bed is a trunk in the bottom like all the way down to the bottom is packed too we tetrarize this thing hey isaiah what are we trying to do Get to Kaneka to get some bacon. Sausage. Sausage. So you want the meat? And if we don't get sausage, we're just gonna be left with tube steak. Oh look, it's my boat. Isaiah, you bought me a boat to take to the beach. Billy uh, Judy, it's that should be our boat. Okay. It does say Billy Judy. Hey Nana. so far.
far? No, I'm concentrating. So turn it off! It's extremely windy, so I got the camera in the truck, but we're at Orange Beach, Alabama, so six hours later. see me in his armpit. Sorry, I wasn't even going to finish yeah. off. Mm. Mm.